Hey guys, my name's Katie and I'm super excited about today because I am finally going to open my package from Carity. Um, in case you don't know, they are the maker of one of my very favorite palettes and they are really inexpensive. This palette I think was 25 or 28, something like that. Um, and it is gorgeous and they just released brand new liquid lipsticks that they claim are pizza proof like legit on the website when you order it says that they're pizza proof so I ordered some pizza on the way home and we're gonna test that out I'm gonna open up I didn't buy all the colors but I bought quite a few between me and the bestie so we're gonna open this up and do some swatches and then I'm gonna put some, I'm gonna swatch everything on my lips, but um, after I'm gonna do the swatches from lightest to darkest. And then after the swatches, I'm gonna eat some pizza. And we're gonna see if the claims that they are pizza proof are legit. So, I'm excited about this. Oh, the packaging on these is just really simple and it's got carroty humongous on it. So, we ordered, oh my gosh, I did not order, I did not know we ordered this many. Um, they're only $6 a piece. Um, I will put the link in the description box below. If you spend $35, you get free shipping. So, not bad, that's, I think I ended up spending close to 50, but you know. We got the shade, can you see that, Purdy. Uh, we've got tea leaves. Steph, Tamar, Snuggly, Fade Out, Vinyl, which is probably the one that I'm going to wear while I eat pizza because it's black and it'll show up really good how much it wears off, and Soho. So I'm really excited about this so excited about this. Snuggly looks the palest, so I'm gonna do that one first. Ooh. These are pretty. You guys can see this. Man, there we go. So it's just a really like baby, baby pink. Oh, I just blinded myself. Okay, this is what it looks like on the lips. It's not bad. It's not my color. I'm pretty sure this is the one of the ones the bestie ordered but I could be wrong but it's a very pretty pink if you are into pinks so there is that one and now we'll remove that and move on to the next one okay on to the next one and we will do party looks like that is the next lightest cutest pink color oh carity is a while well, i'm trying to get this open carity is a cruelty free brand and i'm seeing vegan symbols on these lipsticks so it looks like at least most if not all of these are vegan as well which is awesome for the people that do. Okay, this is just another cute little pink. Looks like it's gonna be very similar to the last one. Ooh, it's just a little bit kind of brighter. So there's that pink. The top one is um, the first color, and then this bottom one is purdy.
This one seems like it might be a little bit more pigmented, but this is what it looks like on the lips. Okay. All right, next is going to be Tamar. This I know is the besties because she was super excited about this color. This is Tamar in the thing. Ooh. And this is Tamar swatch. You can see Snuggly and Purdy have already dried down. And then this one is Tamar. I've been doing a fantastic job of applying that, but this is what Tamar looks like on the lips. I like this color a lot. It's just kind of like peachy almost. I like that a lot. Okay. Wow, that dried down fast. Okay, and then next we'll do Fade Out. This is what it looks like. We're just getting a little deeper into the nudie pinks here. Ooh, that is pretty. I like that a lot. Okay, so this one is Tamar, this one is Fade Out. I like that a lot. Okay, this is what it looks like on the lips. And next we will do tea leaves. Starting to get into the darker ones now. And as you can see, this was fade out, and then this is tea leaves. Ooh, I love that. This is what tea leaves looks like on the lips. I have a feeling I'm gonna wear this one a lot. That's nice. It's just neutral enough, but just vampy enough too, like. I feel like this would be like work appropriate if I do a really neutral eye, but also like out appropriate if I do a sparkly eye. All about it. Just ignore that I'm taking off like all of my face makeup trying to do this. All right, last three. Let's do Steph next. This is Steph. It looks very berry-ish in the tube. Ooh, that's pretty. It's kind of like a brick almost. So this is Steph over here. Okay, excuse the hot mess that this looks like, but this is the color on the lips. This isn't quite as pigmented as I would like it to be, but a second coat seems to go on pretty easy. So, and I didn't even wait for the first one to dry down. So, not bad, and it's a really pretty color. 
Again, this is Steph. Soho, which is the deep, deep purple color that is just so gorgeous looking. Oh, I hope this one is good. Oh, that's pretty. That is so pretty. This is it right here. And that is so pretty. I'm so excited about this. Okay, get down did a terrible job putting this on my face, but this is what the color looks like on. This is gorgeous. This is so pretty. So pretty. I'm in love. Love, love, love. So that's Soho. The last one is vinyl. This is the one that I'm gonna purposefully let dry down for a minute. And then we're gonna eat some pizza and see how it wears. Um, but I can tell you right now that I've been having trouble getting them off, even without letting them dry down fully. So it's looking good so far. This is a black called vinyl. This is it swatched. I don't know how pigmented it's gonna be, but we'll see. Okay, this is it on the lips. This is vinyl. I did go in for an extra dip, but I'd say this is pretty pigmented. I'm really happy with this black. So these are all of the swatches. The only one that hasn't dried down so far is the black one that I just did. I'm gonna let this dry down on my lips for a minute. Okay, I feel like that has dried down enough to where it should be a good test. These do seem to be pretty transfer proof. There's a kiss test for that one. And I mean, I can probably well rub on those and they aren't going anywhere. So, I'm hungry. I'm gonna eat pizza and I got extra cheese on this. And it's still warm, thankfully, cause I'm hungry. Okay, so this is what the black looks like after a pizza piece of pizza. Um, I would not call this pizza proof, but honestly, even my Kat Von D's, if I eat something as greasy as a pizza, they're going to look about like this too. I mean, for a $6 liquid lip, I'm impressed with this. Like, and this is the black one. If you're wearing one of the more neutral colors one of the pinks or you know the skin tones like those are just gonna blend on that much more with your skin that's kind of why you ate it with the black on to kind of show exactly how it's doing um, because if you're using a lighter one like it's just going to blend in a little bit more and not be so bad but I do still have color like I could easily just throw on a lip gloss mush my lips together a little bit and not have to reapply. So, that's something to think about. No, it's not exactly pizza proof, 
but for six dollars i'm excited about this this is pretty awesome thumbs up to my peeps at carity um but anyway that's my video for you guys um like i said i'll leave the link for the liquid lips um down below if you have any questions leave them in the comments i'm gonna eat some more lunch and i'll see you guys later